Hey, good evening, and uh, thank you so much for joining us. Good evening. Mm -hmm. uh, firstly, uh, let's just uh, to uh, end the questions that are being asked. Initially, the Colonel Dakola was accorded a state funeral by the head of state, and we understand that has now changed. He will now be accorded a hero's funeral. What brought about the change? For all we know, he has been accorded a hero's status as a hero for a national liberation struggle for what he really was and uh, what went for. Uh, all the others are English um, uh, flavors. What is important is that no one can dispute the fact that late uh, retired uh, Colonel uh, Bulunganga was a hero of the Namibian struggle. And that's what the president uh, recognized as a hero. Whether you want to call it a state funeral or official funeral, mm -hmm. that does not derogate from the fact that he's being recognized as a hero of our struggle. Mm. What, what then is the difference between a hero's funeral and a state funeral, just to uh, give a, a proper definition of the two? Uh, maybe it's just the, 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 the level of uh, state engagement in terms of uh, uh, preparations, arrangements, cost implications, uh, everything. Heroes are not uh, Siamin twins. Everyone has got a level of contribution, and therefore uh, you cannot have me, as a veteran of the struggle, be uh, recognized the same level as a real hero like uh, uh, the late uh, Mburunganga, mm. who really demonstrated and has got visible um, marks uh, in this country in terms of achievements him and his comrade in, comrades in arms mm -hmm. uh, who uh, really uh, participated in decisive battles uh, like the battle of uh, Mapongolo uh, and, and other battles where they dislodged the enemy forces, they captured weaponry, uh, and they, they really um, uh, did serious uh, thrashing uh, on the enemy. They contributed to the enemy realizing that uh, the final... Uh, nail should be uh, to, to, to talk to each other. Mm -hmm. Now, one of the questions that many people have also been asking is, uh, what is the criteria that is taken into consideration when according funerals uh, of this nature to individuals? In other words, if there were to be a ticker box, what are the attributes that one needs to, to have to be, to, 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 to be recognized as a hero and accorded uh, this honor? We shall go into that public education if the, if the public is informing us as the ministry responsible for information and communication. Um, and adding technology, if the public really does not uh, have those uh, differences, we are going to go into that. But they should not mar uh, the funeral arrangements for, for late uh, um, Dakolo. Um, uh, uh, he's given all the full honors of a hero of the, of the liberation struggle, um, uh, accorded to him in his right, given his uh, contribution. And there is no doubt about that. As to go into the dictionary uh, gimmicks of the English language, you know, the use of the inter interchangeable use of terminologies like state, yeah. official, hero, and all that, the common thing is that we are honoring our hero. Uh, and that's why we are here. If he was not a hero, we wouldn't be here. And the president, uh, in consultation, would not have arrived at that decision. Mm. Uh, lastly, who decides on, on whether or not the, the individual who has been identified uh, as a hero and accorded uh, a hero's funeral should be buried at Hero's Acre or not? Who, who is the last? There is an that? act of parliament mm. that speaks to the conferment of, uh, of uh, on national honours. Um, uh, and uh, you will recall that at uh, ten, the turning of uh, events like the Hero's Day or the Independence Day, they are living and uh, past heroes and heroines who are conferred medals on. But then uh, when uh, the time comes when someone departs this earth, this country, land of, of the brave, in spirit to uh, we all believe to heaven, then that time also dawns on us uh, for the leadership uh, through His Excellency to pronounce itself. Uh, there is in that act also establishes an adversary committee on the conferment of uh, a status, national status, uh, a hero, uh, hero's uh, funeral, uh, state funeral, official uh, funeral, looking at uh, the set criteria. But as I said, we are going to, uh, to spare good time when we have uh, 
uh, uh, passed the, the honoring of our fallen hero to educate the public.